gonna see. We're gonna see if uh if it lets me resume. And I'm good, how are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. We just vibing. Tater, what's up? What's good? I hope I don't have to restart. <laughs> I'm about to speed run this game. You smell bad? Damn. Oh nice. Okay, I can I can continue. That's how you wanna greet me? Is this scary? Um so far it hasn't been scary. I don't think I don't think it's gonna be scary moving forward. It's like a it's a uh, decision based story game. That's pretty much what I can say. Good night. All right, Tater. Have a good night. Big boy, that DLC, the Africa pack came out. I was a little upset. Oh, okay. Here we go. Okay, so he he already ate dinner. I'm turning this TV off. Said you can turn it on. This is a game anyway. I saw it and I was like, what is she playing? Yes, uh, it's like so you know you know Detroit. Oh, okay. Can we back at this part? So yeah, it's like it's like Detroit become human, but uh, just older, pretty much, and like a different story. Oh yeah, let me juggle again. Okay, here we go. Okay, I can't mess it up. I did it perfectly last time. Hey, Dad. Yeah. I, I gotta go. Good night. All right, time. Astro. Have a good night, bro. Thanks for stopping you in. You could teach me too. Yeah, I sure. can teach you, buddy. I'll show you if you like. Boom. Okay. I just wanted to make sure he saw that. I feel like that's uh, that's gonna be good for the story. Ah, uh, Sean. What a smart young man. Sorry that I didn't watch your brother. I'm sorry that I didn't also buy you a balloon. I wish I could have been a better father. But things got tough. And your mother left me. She left me for a zucchini. <laughs> that goddamn zucchini. I should have saw it from the start. Alright. Kind of like Life is Strange? Yeah, pretty much. Kind of like that. bag of chips and he didn't even eat it i'm blocking his tv i know he about to come over and try to turn it on i'm about to stiff arm you don't do it don't do it bro my game freeze again <laughs> at this same part i'm going to be hurt go to bed turn the tv off it's time for you to go to sleep Dad, I got dark turn quick. it off. It was my favorite show. Turn it back on, Dad. Is that a question? Are you demanding me? See, I would have turned it on if you asked me. But now I gotta stay off. Come on, Sean. It's time for bed. I'm not tired yet. Can I stay up a little longer? I don't care if you're not tired. Go to sleep! Now, that's not very reasonable, is it? You have school tomorrow. You have to get some sleep. All right, I'm going. Are you coming with me? Yeah, I'll come with you, bro. Go brush your teeth and put on your pajamas. I'll come up. <laughs> Don't stay up. Nah, he gotta go to bed. He going to sleep right now. He got these chips and he didn't even eat them. Now nah, I gotta eat them. I don't even want these fucking chips. You gotta carry to retirement? No, he's not. Because I'm never gonna retire. Come on, Sean. Let's go to bed. But you a savage day? <laughs> I just want to make sure he's getting the proper amount of sleep. <laughs> Not this man pushed me out the way. Um, but I thought he was going to bed. He's about to brush his teeth or something? Oh, damn, I can't even go in there. Bro, Ethan, come on. What was this? Oh, <gasps> no. Damn. Wait, so how did... How did Jason only die? Did Ethan even get hurt? I don't understand. They both were in the street when the, when the car, like, pulled up. Let's close this. 
Damn, that's sad, bro. I mean, really drew a picture of his brother like, getting hit by the car, bro. Good night, Sean. My teddy. I haven't got my teddy, Dad. You must have left it somewhere in the house. Do you have any idea where it could be? No, Dad. Please, I can't sleep without him. Get your teddy. Too bad. <laughs> I kind of want to say that. Nah, I ain't gonna do that to him. All right, I'll have a look around and I'm see back, if you I cute can find it. Welcome okay? back, not rag. That's the real reason why your wife left. Ethan kept Jason in front to take the impact. Nah, I don't think he did that. Ethan would never. All right, let me find the teddy. Oh wait. Is Ethan like a what's the name of those people that draw blueprints for like construction buildings? Contractor? Look like he's a contractor. Oh wait, no, nah, I can't go to sleep yet. I gotta find Teddy. Yo, Ethan treats his morning son. He hates children. This is two years later, bro. <laughs> it's not like it's not like it's the day after. Wait, I should not be looking through this right now. Gotta find Teddy. Oh, this is just personal. Anytime we got the the personal label on it. Always something bad. When the parents came home from church, all their children were gone. They searched and called for them. They cried and begged. But it was all to no avail. The children had never been seen again. Man, you don't get that shit out of my face. It's all good, Wimpy. But yeah, two two years passed. They did a they did a time skip. Organi Keller. <laughs> His face is so funny. This have confirmed that the uh, modus operandi, operandi, indeed. Oh. We got two bathrooms. It's not even really a bathroom. It's a toilet. Where's his, where's his, where's his teddy at? Oh, there it is. Ethan is very pleased that he found this. He turned his damn TV off. How did the TV even come back on? I turned this off. Oh, it's not even a TV. Wait, what is that? The TV is making noise, but it's not on. We got a ghost in here, bro. Definitely a ghost in this house. It smells like it smells like must and hot sauce. Yeah, this house definitely smells sour. Luckily, Ethan's good with handling balls, or it'd be hard. A uh, hard time being single. <laughs> hey, that's that's uh that's pretty true though. That's pretty true. You're good at Thanks, juggling. Thanks, Dad. Thanks, Diana. Good night, Sean. Get some rest, champ. Right. Dad. Yeah. Why do you look so sad? Because you're sad. I think I just need some time. I'm sad because you look to sad. To get back to the way things were. You know, Dad, what happened to Jason wasn't your fault. Aw, Sean. Good night, Sean. That was a good kid. I should have let him stay up. Damn. That hit different. That really hit different, him saying that. It's not even my life, and I, I still feel some type of way about what he just said. That really hit different. this kid all right good night. let me turn
turn his lights off. Don is a good son, bro. This hurts so bad. It really does. He just repeats the lesson he learned from his daddy. <laughs> oh! <laughs> okay, I gotta I gotta remember that the uh the dotted lines means that I'm not supposed to do it quick. Oh, okay. And having having a flashback. Is my bro passing his name is Jason? Really? Oh shit, that's crazy, Flux. Flux, I'm really sorry to hear that, bro. That's such a crazy coincidence. 2018. How are you? How are you doing now? No, I know you're not like you know fully over that. Well, like, oh, I damn. That's three years later. That's three years later, and I know, I know it's still. I'm really sorry to hear that. Wait, well I got origami. How to do it in the newspapers? You been tripping. <laughs> that man had a perk, bro. I gotta remember that. What did I say? Carnaby Corner in North? Who is this guy? Might be the origami killer. That's what I'm thinking. Why he just got origami in his hand randomly? Oh, we playing. We playing L.A. Noir. Yo, this big ass. Y'all saw the way the car came back up after he got out. We got a motel. You know what happened at motels, right? It's either sex, drugs, or killing. This dude looks familiar. Be 40 this year. Oh, so that was your older brother? Yeah, again, man, I'm really sorry about that. Why killer get dope ass nicknames? Or you know, people trying to fucking sleep. <laughs> nah, there's no sleeping being done in motels. Ring any bells. Nope. Don't forget, Can't say it does. infidelity too. People come here to cheat. I'm a full-time uh, Richie watcher, starting from now. From now? <laughs> but yeah, back to the game. Nah, it's all good, Flux. Don't, don't feel bad for bringing that in. Don't feel bad. Don't oh, feel bad. that Lauren Winter. Third floor, Open last door on chef. the left at the you end of the court. You calling me? Oh, that was, uh, wait, which one was Chef? I know it was Oompy and Chef. Which one was Chef, though? Was he Jason or uh, Sean? <laughs> I really just bribed this man. Ooh, cutscene. Oh, it's not even a cutscene. <laughs> right, Nala? That's all it takes is $5? That's what happens when you don't care about your job. You take anything. Bro, literally gave you info for only five dollars, right? <laughs> That's all it takes. I'll probably do the same thing, low key. If I'm working at a motel, bro. I don't give a fuck. Lauren Winter. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. You about to see me? Wait. It's fifty bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. Fine by me. Thought I had fifty dollars. <laughs> Jokes on you. Put your money on the table. We got exactly ten minutes when the alarm rings. It's over, okay? Oh shit, he do got a fifty. He's falling. Take a look on this. around here real quick. What got going on? She's not concerned about this man walking around the motel. You're not even turned. I guess when you do this, like as an occupation, you just don't even. Care. You should take your clothes off. We ain't got all day. You first. Actually, I'm not a customer. You first. Oh, 
shit, a cop. I should've known. What you want, a freebie? Is that it? Detective Snitchy? <laughs> My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private right? detective. Only 50? The families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. I already told the police all I know and I have me nothing to add. This man. Leave me alone. Look. I understand, Lauren. I know what you're going through. Oh yeah? You know what it feels like to find your own son's you know body that? on a wasteland? I'm sorry, I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Well, damn. Trying to be... Uh, There'll nice. be other victims if we don't stop the killer. I mean, understand. You have got to help me, Lauren. You may know something that can aid the investigation. And tell me what I help came you? here for. There's nothing you can do. My son's dead, do you hear me? He's dead. And... If we don't find the killer, there'll be other mothers who find their son's body on a deserted wasteland. But, but, but you're right. Oh, he gets straight Why to the point. Why should you care? He gets straight to the it's point. It's not your problem anymore, right? Aw. Uh, <laughs> Damn, we really making her feel bad. Her son died. But we about to get that information, though. What do you want to know? Look at the look on her face. Yo, tell me what I need to know right now. Bad. <laughs> um, fuck. Disappearance. Where he disappeared? How did your son disappear? Where was he? He used to go play with the neighborhood kids after school. It was pouring down something awful that day. I'll never forget yeah, it. Yeah, she I. All his friends came home around five. I'll accept him. What the police When did do? you sound the alarm? About eight o'clock. I began to get worried. I went all around the neighborhood. I went to the wasteland where they like to play. I went to see his friends. I called the cops about 10 o'clock. I wonder if I can look out the window. Perfect. I'm about to get oh. Smoke. No thanks, I quit. That's brave. I can look out the window. Nice. Perfect, perfect scene. Oh, it's not. Is it really a murderer? That's wild. <laughs> for real. Oh wait, we can't, we can't, we can't say it's him for sure yet. Um, any leads? Is that it? No more questions? No, no! Not done. Do you know if they found anything on the wasteland? Any leads or witnesses? Alright, I got you. Give me he said he must have run away and he'd probably end up coming back. His body was found five days later with a Norigami figure in his hand and an orchid on his chest. Tell me about Johnny. Got 50 bucks. What kind of kid was he? Johnny was really a good Very boy. Missed as well. Uh, Sometimes minutes left over anyways. He fought with other kids who oh, called you me a freak, bro. What's wrong it. with you? In his own way, I think he understood what was going on. What was on his chest? <laughs> oh, an origami. He had an origami on his chest. On his body. Wait, I got two more. Oh shit. Um, I didn't learn squat. Well, worth a try. Oh shit! Oh, I thought he said that out loud. I'm gonna say, what the? I should have eased up on her. Looks like she's still in shock. I'll leave my card on the kitchen table. You never know. Yeah, right. Uh, tact is not my strong suit. <laughs> No point in pushing her. She's not gonna tell me anymore. Well, if you remember anything, the smallest thing. Or I mean, his hand is something else on his chest. Give me a oh call. shit! I gotta, I gotta, uh, I gotta pay attention. I missed that.
that need a healer in any any type of these stories bro they just die because they either lose it or they, somebody Lauren. take it from Lauren, open up, baby. please being poisoned nah, he didn't uh he didn't consume like, anything or nothing. sorry doll but i really wanted to see ya. oh nah can i can i go in here oh hold up I'm about to beat his ass What do you want, asshole? Lauren, is everything all right? She's okay. She's just swell. Now beat it, loser. And beat these nuts. Let's try to get up in here. You again? Yeah. <laughs> You're looking for trouble. He said you again, it. like I wasn't gonna leave. Like what the fuck? Beat the shit out of you. Oh. Mm, bitch. Bow. Bow. Yeah. Give me that. Mm. Mm. We. Ow! Through the glass! Bald ass head! Mm -hmm. Oh yeah! Oh we shit! Damn! Ugh. Oh yeah, I ain't get hit by that! Come here! Ugh. Ugh, get off me! Get off me! Get off me! Oh shit! Oh he beat me up, bruh! Oh! Okay, we Okay! Oh I know your hand hurts. Oh, she got a bottle. Okay, I can't fuck this up. I can't fuck this up. I can't fuck this up. Okay. Ah! Get off me. Mm, okay. How did I fuck that up? There's no way. There's no way I messed that up. Bow, bow. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm fucking up. Uh, bow. Damn, we pushed you that hard? Mm. Mm hmm. He's, he's picking up everything. This man is literally using everything he can get his hands on. He's still getting his ass beat. Bow! Pussy ass. Pick up something else. I'll see you again, asshole. You ain't gonna see me nowhere. I'll see you in hell. Are you alright? <laughs> Better him, <laughs> This I old man ass fight, bro, right? <laughs> Our next client, Casey Nebula, what's up, bro? <laughs> he was getting violent, and I told him I didn't Damn, want to see him. Damn, I'm mad I fucked up that much. Well, you should be careful. He'll probably be back. Sorry about the mess. Mr. Shelby? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime, sugar. Oh. I'm good. How are you? I'm doing good, bro. By his face like that, I just got done beating somebody's ass, bro. As you can see, he got a couple hits on me, but it's all good. I made him run. Oh. But you got him fucked up. <laughs> I was I was messing up. I was messing up a little bit, a little too many times, bro. I ain't, I ain't want to mess up. But it's all good though. I still won the fight. Who is this dude? <laughs> good shit. I tried. I tried. Try my best. The ass hit him with that wee wee boom boom bat pow. But you a comic book character, bro? <laughs> Being a comic book. Pow! So the last dude was a detective. This dude's a cop. Gotta be. Oh shit. Good. Damn, everybody got something going on, bro. Having that bio though. You got that shit from uh, that Spider Man movie. One with Jamie Foxx. You better turn into Electro. This man does not look okay. Whoa. This is camera angle. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, who's horny? Not you coming in here asking who's horny. You're not gonna say hi, Moss? You're not gonna say hi? It's like that man, uh. Man of Madonna shit. I don't know what that is. 
zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent I'm a police officer. FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. By the way, I think an orchid was left on the chest. Oh, an orchid. That's a uh, that's a flower, right? Check. Why the fuck? <laughs> why why did they take a picture of this man from the side? I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Fine. This man looking for mercy. He said, hey, I got your emotes. He's like, you nothing but a side profile. Ah, but look, he's a police officer. He got to be more professional. You're a menace? what I do? What's this? Video memo recording. Oh, shit. Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden. Tuesday, October 4th, 2000. This is some half life shit. Time is 8.40 in a.m. Are you just playing this tonight? I'm not sure. Might play some knockout mode. Nah, this reminds me of Deus Ex. It was exactly like this. But was that a game? Trying to play Smash tonight? No, I'm not trying to play Smash. Unrelated to the investigation. Unrelated to the investigation. I'm looking for Lieutenant Carter Blake. <laughs> not a word. He's just pointing. Thanks. Thank you. Oh wait, I nah, put those back on. We need those for the investigation. Oh wait, put those back on. Also, oh, it is a game? What kind of game is it? The blood report uh, indicates an advanced and long-lasting yeah, state of exhaustion. What the hell's going on? So, uh, I'm a new character right now. I'm a detective something. His name is Jaden. I think, that, I think that's his last name. But uh, I pulled up to a crime scene, so I don't even know what's going on for it. I'm assuming somebody died. Nothing else on the ground? Lieutenant Blake, I'm well, Agent Rama Jay from too. the FBI. I yeah, went by your office this morning, they told me to be here. There's definitely more. Now, if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. <laughs> What's I like in this game is so well? Are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about six o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on uh, what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. You just now getting here? Uh, Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. See any witnesses? Any witnesses? None yet. Given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. So they, they're not snitching. Uh, Do we know the cause of death? There are no marks on the body. 
Chances are he was drowned. I was just about to like say the that. others. Tony, I don't want to see a single shit stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Yes, Lieutenant. Um... There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No. No, of course not. That's... That's not what I meant. Listen, I, I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later, back at the office? Well, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest. I feel like I didn't ask the right question. Hey, Jaden, you come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. I don't like this dude. Sample of no interest. Comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland. This part is extremely slow. Okay, what's up? I'm not finding anything new. TikTok? Okay, give me one second. I'm gonna watch it right after this part. Bro, this part is so slow. Did I find everything? Lightstorm. It's been uh, it's been pretty interesting so far. The, la the last part was uh was pretty interesting. This is like the only part that's been really Very slow. Common. Traces of footprints leading toward the body. Yeah, I literally just got. In a they fight. don't look like those of the Old police. Man has no correlation with the body. Something fucking wrong with one of my clients. Okay, I guess I can tell you about the other stuff. Oh wait. Is this in the air? Ooh, hold up. Harry, comment. The victim is lying on his back. Oh, this is the body. No visible signs of violence. His face is covered with mud. Oh, like yeah, so it is a wound. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest. Okay, Kate, I see you. There's the origami. A small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. <laughs> okay, Kate, I see you. Superficial wound on the right thigh. Blood analysis suggests it could be post-mortem. Probably a scratch that occurred when the body was being moved. Small wound on the right thigh. And the blood is the same as on the tracks. The victim is Jeremy... Wait, what? Why did they finish? The victim is Jeremy Bowles. Declared missing five days ago. See reference file. Some uh, 1950 Detroit become human. Yeah, for real. <laughs> it just looks like it looks like an older version of Detroit. I'm gonna leave. I see you in the office, right? Okay. See you later. Wait, I thought I was supposed to tell him what I found. Man, whatever.
Or that uniforms look like something out of Fire Force. I forgot all about the truck with some lizards. Why you call it lizards? <laughs> Oh wait, I don't want to be back out here. Fucking hey, this part was boring as hell. I got caught up with the girl in the underground place and got lost trying to run away. Talking about on Detroit. I haven't played that game, so like any uh, any parts that you're talking about from that game, I would not. I would not recommend. Don't think, Ethan. Business. Give me the first idea oh, that pops into wait. your head. Wait, wait. Spark plug? Steering column? Tie rod? Pilot bearing? Oil pan gasket? Carburetor. Intake manifold. O2 sensor. Oh, it's wheel. Converter. It's wheel. Wheel hub. Brake shoe. It gotta be wheel. Quarter panel? <sighs> Headers? Oh, yeah, this is my son, Headers. AC compressor. Hubcap? Block? Fucking tow hitch? Wire and harness. I don't know half of these things. Wiper hey. blades. Fucking lug nut? Distributor. <laughs> Distributes that dip. Dipstick. Alternator? The kid's name was Battery Terminals. Oil pan. Cabin filter. What the actual fuck is his name? I've got it. Flux capacitor. Really has been Talk to me. I didn't understand half of those things that he was saying. Oh, this is definitely a butterfly. The butterfly. A wolf. A wolf's head. Uh, it's a crab. A crab. Y'all <laughs> yeah, know a lot about cars. Uh, I'll say death. I like the Grim Reaper. Death. Death. What the fuck are we? Like I'm in a cathedral. This the whole game was great. You talking about uh, Detroit? Yeah, I heard a lot of good things about that. I have the results of your MRI scans. Everything seems to be normal. There is no physical damage from the accident. What? However, I am How worried about your hurt? psychological condition. I know it's not easy. But you've got to start oh, over, Ethan. Into You're not responsible for what happened. It's my fault Jason is dead. This dude looked like Elon Musk. He'd still be alive if I'd been looking out for him. It was an accident. Accidents happen every day. You can't blame yourself forever for your son's death. How is Sean? But it was his fault, though. To be honest. Um, it's been a little distance. He's a this very a solitary thing. kid, you know, very focused within himself. He's really close to his mother. With me, he's more distant. And what about you, Ethan? What do you feel? I feel like shit. I stopped living at the same time Jason did. Get the pain. And that car ran into us. Is there something else you wanted to tell me, Ethan? Yeah, that part. I forgot about that. Oh shit. Um, uh, 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 which one was it? Was it two? Have there been any cases of 
split personality developing after a concussion. Like people doing things but having no memory of what they've done. Like somebody else had been doing them. We know that in certain cases, a violent shock to the brain can cause serious psychological disturbances, like schizophrenia, for example. That's the end of this session. Uh, we'll continue this conversation next week. You were lucky, Ethan. It's very rare to survive such a traumatic accident. I don't exactly feel Man, I'm not trying to hear that. <laughs> this man look weird. He look creepy as fuck. The way he looking. Can't be trusted. Aren't you gonna go play with the other kids? I don't feel like it. Hey, Sean got drip low key. All right, let's uh, what's wrong? Is something the matter, Sean? You know, I'm all right. You're lying to me. How did things go at school today? The teacher yelled at me for being late again. That's She's probably gonna send me home the next time it happens. Harvey eat this one. I'm sorry about that, Sean. Oh, yeah, it's Next time, we'll really pull it together, okay? Damn, bro, get this man to school all the time. Do you want to eat something? You're too smart to be getting in trouble. Sean used to love going to the park, laughing and messing around. Man, he was so happy. But that was before, with Jason. What am I going to do to cheer him up? We're just not communicating. Feels like we're drifting apart. Sean looks so miserable. I wish I could help him. Just not sure I can right now. Hey, he Poor got Sean. the. Uh, he probably got into trouble at school because of me. He got the Travis Scott Jordan one. He said he was crazy. Yeah, Sean got drip. Boomerang? You know how to use it? No, not really. I can never make it come back. Can I give it a try? Let me show you, Let me show you how it's done, son. Bree, what's up? How you doing? Alright. So you just take it, and then you throw it. Oh, shit. Alright, so look. So you take it, and then you just reel it back, and you just throw that bit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then you just catch it like this, uh huh? Cause I'm nice. I'm nice. I can do anything, Sean. You can be just like me. All right, take two. Good, sick, but okay. Well, you got sick too. Oh shit! <laughs> Zombie, what's up, bro? Nasty. You talking about Bree being sick? Uh, and then we catch it again. Whoa, you did it, Dad. Yes, but sir. You give it a try? Sean, I won't try it, be bro. Able to do it. Oh, come on, uh, let's try it together. Yourself. Now, the main thing is to get the right position at the beginning. Now, you gotta throw it straight and a little to the right. Hmm. Okay. Now, throw it. Yay. Okay, Sean. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, he's I clean! Did I did it, Dad. Good job. I think I heard Sean. his game uh, from some Jason scene. That wasn't yeah, so you probably hard. talking about the beginning where he was like, Jason, 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 Jason. <laughs> they go ice bag looking real nice. Ain't no way. They get Sean a goon. Sean really is a goon. This man's smart as hell, too. That was gonna hit his forehead. Yeah, it did. It did look like they're setting it up for this man to get hit. Wait, Bree, did you uh, did you get sick like the first day you got back? Hey, come get on the seesaw with me. I haven't been on a seesaw in a long time. 
What do you think? Yeah. Hey, let's go. We're bonding. We're bonding. I feel like something bad about to happen, bro. Nothing ever goes good in this game. Come on, Dad, make me fly. You sure you want to do that? <laughs> well, look at a rainbow. There's a rainbow back there. I'm glad Sean is having fun, bro. We've gone through enough. <laughs> Let's go, Sean. Maniacs, what's up, bro? We got a sore throat, I think, Saturday while we were uh, in San Antonio and then, uh, then truly got sick uh, Tuesday night. Oh, okay, okay. Damn, that's ass. What do you think it is? It just, you think it's just a cold or something? I think it's called Cherry Bomb, and you just uh, destroy each other's asses on the seesaw. Cherry Bomb? That sounds terrible. Then you took a video of the chasing scene where someone didn't complete any of the actions, and it was hilarious. <laughs> How do you not complete any of the scenes on that part? It must be a different part then. Oh, you know what? It gotta be a different part. It gotta be. Because that, that scene didn't really have any quick time event. It is terrible. I hated it. Wait, you did that shit with me? Bro, we did some stupid shit as kids. I used to do some dumb shit, bro. What's up, Rich? How are you? I'm doing good, Maniacs. Thanks for asking, bro. Thanks for asking. How you doing, bro? They just have a runny nose, uh, so that's congestion now. My ears are clogged, too. Oh, fuck. It might, it might just be a cold or something. Hopefully, it's just a cold. Speak for yourself, Glizzy. <laughs> okay, I'm going to say, like... I'm gonna say most most boys most boys did some dumb shit when they were younger. See, girls girls don't really do a lot of dumb shit. They uh they knew something was stupid. It was like, yeah, I'm not doing this. They pretty much they just what they watch the boys do the dumb shit. And they're like, yep. There they go being dumbasses. I oh, like let's get some candy. Get, uh, strawberry. I think it's just a head cold. Okay, yeah. Yeah, they gotta just be a head cold. Thanks. Give me that candy, bitch. Don, I have some candy for you. I am girls. <laughs> okay, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Hey, I got you some chewies. I hate strawberry. Stra How do you not notice, Ethan? What the fuck? Thanks. It was nice of you anyway. Come on, you suck. Ever playing football uh, in the snow and minimal clothing? Why would you do such a thing? All right, we out of here. Looks like rain's coming. Bro, I used to jump from the top of trees. Dead ass? You never heard yourself before? I'm good, chilling, uh, chilling back to having one, uh, you know, one job now. Hey, okay. Before. Okay, I'm, I'm happy for Jason you, bro. Was still here. How many jobs you had before? Yeah, like two, right? Could just be the way it was I couldn't imagine having more than one job, bro. I know that shit was stressful. Me too. All shady man stealing the candy in the children's park. Okay, bum. Damn. Come oh, on, man. Get this man a break. He's he just trying to make a living. Maybe, maybe he just, uh, maybe he's, he's just trying to be a good guy. Maybe he know that, uh, the kids come here with their parents after school, and maybe they want some candy. Her brother hey, will Dad, always do really dumb shit to try to get me involved. I? I was the same way with my sister. Sure. Go pick a horse and get on. Only difference is I'll my sister ticket. would usually get involved with my dumb shit. <laughs> Me and my sister would do dumb shit together all the time. But I would, I would have to convince her a lot of the time. One, please. How do you hate strawberries? No, oh, man. It just be like that. Sometimes you just don't like it. I'm still warm, uh, so back then I could care less. Oh, okay. Probably got sick a lot, though. I like seeing Sean happy, bro. That man literally saw his brother die right in front of him. How the fuck is it always raining here, bro? 
Okay, you had two before? Okay, okay. That's what's up. So what, uh, what made you leave your other job? If you don't mind me asking. from the past. I should be tripping me. Oh! Oh! I'm so glad this man didn't get hit by that fucking truck, bro. Where's his son? I'm assuming this is like... gotta be like he's he's having like a dream or some shit bro or like a, a hallucination John! 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 this can't be real oh his bag is right here no this can't be real life this gotta be a hallucination he couldn't have lost his son again bro ethan come the fuck on John! come on He blacked out while someone's on a horsey thing. I really hope this this is a hallucination. I really hope it is. I think Nakoshi should be free. I agree. I think it should be too. Oh fuck. <laughs> is he in his room? Come on! This can't be real life. When is he gonna wake up? Bro, Ethan, you fucking suck, bro. How does this happen twice? Come on. He was supposed to go see his mom this weekend. And they're going to origami. It's crazy how we go from playing Resident Evil. The main character's name is Ethan. He's a great father. Let me go to playing this. His name is still Ethan. He's a trash father. Bruh. This man, he's he's tarnishing the name Ethan. He really is. Why does the detective again? Detective Jaden. Still think Nago City should be free. I already read that, Rockstar. I said I think it should be too. That man does not know where he's going, bro. Take long? What does that mean? Do you think it's gonna take long? No, he should be finished soon. Too bad. All right. I'm getting up. Oh, putting his glasses on. I didn't hear you. Now you good, bro? It's all good, brother. I wonder if you can play games on this. You got games on your phone? Oh shit. Ooh. Rip breaker. Mm-hmm. Don Yate. I wonder what people are thinking when they look at this man doing this. <laughs> like, what's up with this dude? <laughs> He's like, uh, what? Who the fuck is this man? Why is he doing this? Got games on your glasses? <laughs> Bro, his shoes are dirty too. Get the clean them thing. Alright, this is boring. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of throwing ball at walls. Let's take a good bet. I would do super shit in the snow. Time. Be jumping in snow piles, uh, butt booty naked, then running back inside for dares. But booty naked? Telling me you went outside with no clothes on. Oh, but you different, bro. I could never. Oh. I'm off, Charlene. I'll look at the reports later. Charlene. Cancel all appointments for this afternoon. Okay. Oh, Captain. Agent oh, okay. You have boxes on. The FBI is That's here. better than nothing. 
Jaden, of course, we've been ears. expecting you. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Do you mind tagging along? We can talk as we walk. Yeah, of course. Just walk and talk. I wanted Jane. to introduce myself before getting started, but uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, no, now it's fine. I just have to get to the press conference. We have them every day now. Hmm, Believe mercy. me, it's not always easy finding something oh. to tell them. Fortunately, they hit him sharp as turns. Have you met Lieutenant Blake yet? Yeah, I met that. Yeah, we met this morning. He has his own methods, but he's a good cop. I'm sure you'll get him. Yeah, well, whatever. Do you know how to tie a knot in a necktie? I guess. Do you not know how to do this? To be frank with you, I got a dumb idea. You know how to tie a tie, tie bro? The press are all over us. Come on, now? Oh, shit. Damn. Everyone blind. Quick time to Crept up Fuck. on us, and it's fast becoming a national concern. There are hundreds of killers in this country, but what do you know? This guy is exotic. He leaves flowers and origami figures. Work that one out. Then hey. the press get onto it. Okay, Jaden. And we suddenly bro. become the center of the universe. I'm here to arrest to a serial doing. killer. With all due respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. No. Of course not. All I'm asking is that you make progress Ew, you and <laughs> fast. The press want a perpetrator, and we're gonna have to serve him up on a silver hey, platter. Them bozo, that's what I'm saying. Hmm. He's like, mm, this thing not is bad. sturdy. Goddamn, I can't breathe. <laughs> oh, go see Charlie, and she'll show you to your office. Yeah, check in on the press conference if you're interested. It'll give you an idea of the political Whoa, climate wait. down here. Whoa, wait. That Thank dude that was standing in that door sir. was thick as fuck. God Welcome damn. Welcome to the club, Jaden. Ain't no damn club. Bro, these NPCs be walking around so determined. I don't even know where they going. Turn the blue in the face. Not bad. <laughs> He definitely looked like that shit was tight. What's that dude's haircut? Look at this dude to the right of me. His cut is ugly. And the dude to the left. They both got the same cut. It's just different sides. Five days after he was reported missing. An autopsy will be conducted tomorrow to determine the exact cause of death. But going from first indications, it would seem that he drowned. The state in which the body was found suggests the methodology of the origami killer. You want to talk about the same barber? That barber needs to get, he needs to quit, bro. The police are continuing to, get his to work around the clock to find the murderer as quickly as possible. I'll feel some questions. week? Say so he got weekly cuts? Did he yeah. get at everybody? You said he asked for something else, you indicated another victim for the origami killer. Can you be more specific? An origami figure was found in the victim's hand, and an orchid was placed on his chest. His face was covered with mud, but there were no visible traces of violence in the body. Go ahead. Uh, uh, the cut. The oh, it's half off. Was never identified. <laughs> Perhaps the origami killer wasn't <laughs> found either. I don't think there's much chance of that. For the moment, the killer may think he's invulnerable, but in the end, he'll make a mistake and we'll be there to arrest him. Yes. Did the killer leave any written evidence? Perhaps a ransom note explaining his actions? Or anything like that? No. Yeah, he is not Who's even talking in any way, and we have only the murders to help us understand his motives. Yes. What's the question? Some people are saying that the police were slow to take an interest in these murders because the victims lived in poor parts. I hate of this the game in every scenario in it. Wait, why, Lily? That's absurd. <laughs> also, what's up, no Lily? How you doing? Between victims based on their social class. All right, I'm I'm done with this. I already know where everything that happens. To choose his victims from the more impoverished parts of town. The you want to get out of my way? If you think about it, uh, the best killers you would never know existed because they were never caught and the bodies were never found. That is true. There's killers out there that haven't even been uh, convicted or like suspected. Cause nobody can find the bodies of sad people. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to sit in there and listen? I didn't leave behind any evidence or a whole ass body. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure he left behind the body. Well, in this case, the town hall's been applying pressure to I'm pretty sure he left behind the bodies on purpose because he put a uh, he put an origami in her hand and an orchid on the chest. He definitely wanted them to be found. Oh, Nala, have a great night. Have a great night. I appreciate you. What's going on, bro? Nagi, what's up, bro? Is it heavy rain? Yes, sir, it is. One question, please, sir. I'll be this game in two days. I just hate it. Uh, it hits too close to home. Oh, really? Hey. That, uh, I want to ask you what happened, but at the same time, this game has been... Everything that's happened in this game has been crazy. So I know, I know whatever it is, it got to be like... You gotta be sensitive. It's like an IRL. He's like the Zodiac killer. Like it's not. Uh, it's not that hard to hide a body. Oh, okay. I thought you just meant like in terms of uh, this guy. What am I supposed to be doing right now? I can't even lie. Their police uniforms are kind of clean. This guy taunting. Yeah, he like he like leave behind traces. It's like he he's doing this shit like it's a game. I'm supposed to go back in here. Oh wait, I already left this. Can't go back. Also hated the dad because how the fuck you don't keep your eyes on your kids? Like that's the one thing. Uh, the one thing. The one job. Yeah, for real, right? <laughs> Ethan, we, we've already deemed Ethan as a terrible father. And we're not even that far into the game. This game has the funniest quick time events. Bro, it really does. It really does. And it, it's typically Ethan. It's typically Ethan with, uh, with the funny ass quick time events. At least so far. Sussy with the Jason. 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 Sean. <laughs> Sean. Jason. He just way to hide a body, just throw it in the ocean like no one would ever think. I uh, would have think to look there unless there are cameras or something. Even in the ocean, it's huge. So how how would you how would you get rid of a body if you lived in the middle of America, where there's no oceans next to you? Nice watch. Didn't you want to get upset with everyone like you stupid oh, bitches? Your fault. Oh, it's the our new lieutenants. We hey, no the same cap. Each year for no the past cap. 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time. It's and the X button. Kind of he slips on a banana. Well. <laughs> you can contribute to our funds. Some Looney Tunes shit. Two, three, four, four. Man, whatever. Congratulate Larry on my behalf. I got money. I'll be sure to do that, sir. So many rivers of currents too strong to find a body. Captain really? Perry said you could show me to my office. Y'all yes, be some. Y'all be some, uh, some good ass killers from the sounds of it. Hey, remind me to never get on y'all bad side. Yo, Kara, what's up? How you doing? What the fuck? Was she gonna let me in here regardless? This? This is my office? That's where I was told to take you. Oh, she was. This is. If you need anything, office. you know where to find me. Yo, this office sucks. Yeah, I'm by the woods too. These fucking deer and uh, crows are ruthless. Oh shit. They be preying on you. In the middle of the US, just buried a body in the middle of nowhere. Disregard okay. the DM I sent you. I'm Time ashamed. To work. Oh, I gotta see it. I'm curious. It looks more like an interrogation room, bro, right? <laughs> does not look like an office. Probably is an old ass interrogation room. Damn. Just throwing everything off the desk. And check to see if there's a trash can on that side. Oh, I'm strong man. Strong man. That's not even worth it. Scary is not. This is spot in America where murder is legal. Wait, what? That ass? Where's that at? Pigs will eat a whole person. If you want to be safe, kill the pig and bury it, or kill the pig, burn it and bury it. Y'all know a lot about getting rid of dead bodies. <laughs> it's a little alarming. I 
feel like the only people that know about getting rid of dead bodies are people that watch too many crime shows or they genuinely thought about killing somebody so they are thinking about getting rid of them why don't you hey bro i haven't wanted to kill somebody it's the place with uh no laws mr beast went there what step the one fuck? where's that at change the office So this man just gonna wear the glasses every time he's here? This one looks good. This is dope. Imagine having glasses like this. This is fire. Not that hard and it's not like you'll be 100%, uh, not like you'll be 100% be convicted. Y'all are insane. All right, what's this one? Under the sea. Under the sea. Come with uh, He said, come with water. I can't remember what he said. He said, come with the bubba. That was what I say that for me. I would not want to be in this. I'm afraid of heights. I hate heights with a passion. Get me out of here. Ew, why would you want to be here too? Oh, is this Mars? Hold on, this is actually pretty dope. I like that. I like the, uh, I like this one though. This one. Uh, what's more, the zone of death had a simple fix. Huh? That's a law. Placing Idaho's portion of Yellowstone inside the District of Idaho, and is less of a problem for people. The parts of Yellowstone will be sunk by a jury. Oh, as a jury. The Congress might as well give Montana the portion of Yellowstone, the District of Montana too. Interesting. Wait, what's interesting? Basically, murder somehow in Yellowstone, you're uh, free to go. What? So realistically, if you wanted to murder somebody, you could trick them into going to Yellowstone. And you just murk them. Well, well, looks like there's something new. Yep. <laughs> Is you're afraid of heights? Yeah, I hate heights. Harry, come in. Tire tracks on the side of the road behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car. Hey, that's good evidence. Geo analysis. Gotta make sure you're in the 50 mile range of the death zone. This shit's really called a death zone. You wanna go to Yellowstone together? Fuck no. Leave them or you just want to bury them. The killer's the car is probably a Chevrolet so Malibu. I have to plant. Here, I feel like I feel like you're planting it specifically because I'm a. So this this got to be the evidence that I found of it. Oh, you're the orchid. All right. Mm, a common species. That doesn't help much. The orchid is a common species. It can be found at any flower shop. It's gonna be fine, trust me. Yeah, I uh, don't believe you. No prints or specific clues. Hmm. Nothing much to go on. This dude is not leaving behind any. Just any one evidence. origami store in town. Ooh, okay. It's a lead. Possibly. Alright, I'm pretty sure I went over it. Yay! Um, files. Really got holographic fire. Playing out gangs of drown people in the ocean and chop them up and put an arrow full of 
and, and toss it in the ocean? <laughs> what the fuck? That's the same dope. Yeah, I would, I would love that. Always the same like ritual. An origami in the hand, an orchid on the chest. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found. Which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. Over 3,500 people questioned. Over 100 suspects interrogated. Not a single lead to go on. This dude is good. The killer is white, aged between 30 and 45. He is intelligent, calm, oh, boy, the and fuck going on in Miami, bro? An organized hey. in a car. Oh, shit, shit just He's probably employed, but Kira, thank you for the gift of self, the Umpy. <laughs> Umpy, welcome back. Wait, so Kara, what, 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 um, what answers would have been wrong answers? Hey, you got a gold bag, Umpy? Okay. Eight victims in the last three years. All boys, aged between nine and thirteen. No signs of violence. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. No one notices anything. Riddles with a gun, you block and report it. All right, that's Bodies fair. Bodies found three to five Fritos days do later. Ass. Only like one, uh, one flavor of Fritos. Rainwater. It's like it's like the twisted one. And it's like, uh, I forgot what flavor they are. But those are pretty good. Excuse me? There's always a railroad line adjacent to where the bodies are found. Nah, but look. You can't, you can't, you can't do that to me unless you had them. In the fall. Unless you had them and you didn't like them. Because they're actually pretty good. Okay, yeah, yeah. They're decent. They're decent. They're not bad. The killer has a large comfort zone. You gain confidence Eight rapidly three years away from his base. Yeah, for real. Yeah, this won't make the geo profiling any easier. So if the killer is Ethan, what what possessed this man to just start killing people? Like, was it was it Jason's death that just made him want to start killing people? All right, I'm done here. But like, don't say it again. All right, bet I'm not. <laughs> not gonna say it again. Oh shit. Why, why every character I play has got a problem? Like, something wrong with them. I think the, the only one that's like close to normal is the detective. Cause they got asthma. Here we go oh, God damn. I'd rather go wash my face. Here we go again. Huh? Then get up. I need to take some. I'm gonna faint if I resist. Oh, shit. Oh, he wobbly. It's all right. Weak in the knees. It. I know. Get to the bathroom. No, I can make it. Oh, what the fuck? No, I'm not taking this bullshit. Get to the bathroom. Is everything all right, sir? Do, do I look okay? You just gonna walk away? You even let me answer. No one must see. Bro. Oh my god. This man's about to die. Oh, fuck. Just hold your hand. Bro, go in the bathroom. two days 1k damn Kara what you been doing that's how I look when I wake up and immediately gotta jump off my book bed to go piss but you be shaking Get those glasses ain't so good I don't think it's the glasses Is that Ethan it's gotta be Ethan 
Lieutenant Blake, Mr. Marshall. Damn, so he really lost Please his son. What, what the fuck? This dude just walked through the